right, Survivors, Paulie Jr. here. Welcome back to The Long Dark. We're picking up where we left off here after the end of the last episode. We're at the community <laughs> hall right now with Father Tommy and all the plane crash survivors. As if you couldn't tell from all the moaning and groaning and coughing and sneezing and wheezing. Um, and it is now morning. And we're going to head out here in a moment. We're just cooking up some Joe by the fire. Oh, looks like it's done. Let's toss that back. Get some caffeine in the system, get it all warmed up, hydrated, and now it's time to boogie. Let's take a look at the map. We have lots to do today. Many side quests need to be completed before this blizzard shows up. We want to go over here to the Joplin's bunker, just down the road, and then over here to check on that ghostly stag. And then finally, back to the Draft Dodgers cabin where we were in the last episode looking for the church artifact. But of course it wasn't there because I missed um, a clue in the church here in town and that is my fault because as some of you have pointed out in the comments We have a quest tracker right here church artifact that tells us exactly what we must do It just requires a little bit of reading on my part, but reading is for the week just like math So yeah, blame me my bed. Anyway, let's roll out. Ooh, that's my bed roll. Better pick that up I did sleep here last night <laughs> Like I said, I wasn't going to, but uh, there is a nice fire here, and it's nice and toasty, so... Alright, out we go. Let's get a gun up. So, I am not bringing the rifle today. Oh my gosh, it's cold. Even with the heating up, warming up benefit, we're still three arrows down. Holy smokes. Um, yeah, I'm not bringing the rifle today. We're nice and light. Check it out. 58 pounds out of 88 total. Um, that rifle is like almost nine pounds. And I feel like the handgun works perfectly fine. We've got plenty of ammunition for it. Shoots super fast if we get attacked by those timber wolves. Um, and we don't know what we're going to find in this bunker and beyond. So I want to make sure we have enough um, carry capacity. So I just thought that the rifle was a little redundant, frankly. So that's my story. I'm sticking to it. And I hope it warms up a little bit. Because this is crazy. All right, first stop is going to be the bunker. We can warm up there when we get there. It's not too far. So let's uh, let's head on over there, Astrid. Warm up inside and hopefully find all kinds of awesome loots. All right, well, we're almost at the first bridge. I'm thinking maybe taking a shortcut. Maybe we should follow the river. I don't think we've ever been on this river before. We might find something interesting on our way over to the bunker. Let's do it. And this might actually give us a little shelter from the wind if we're down in this river. Did I see some cattails? I sure did. Just make sure you don't shoot them. Uh-oh. The coffee has expired in our system. <laughs> what a terrible thing. Man, I wish, we, uh, I wish we had a jug of it. A nice, like, insulated thermos would be amazing in this game. So you can carry hot coffee with you wherever you go. Uh, Astrid's teeth are chattering. How close are we? Um, we're getting there. We're getting there. We might want to cut up through the woods now and just go in a straight line. This river is not blocking the wind as I was hoping. As a widow bunny wabbit. Oh gosh. Um, yeah, this is just like yesterday. Or, well, the last episode. <laughs> with the Draft Dodgers cabin that we found at, in the nick of time just before uh, Astrid froze to death. I think we're really close it's right here. But I can't sprint anymore. We've got no energy left. All the coffee's gone. Just have to find the hatch. Hopefully it's not too well hidden. Uh-oh. Hypothermia so risk. No! There it is! Lay down we made it. No lay down. Stop. Stop talking. Get inside. Can you turn it? Her hands are probably frozen solid. There we go. Woo! We made it! And there's light down here. Fantastic. Okay. Find the journal entry. Let's press J for more information. See, this? I don't normally do this kind of thing because it sort of takes you out of the story, right? It's a little bit um, anti-immersive. Uh, anti it breaks the fourth wall. Like Now we got to come in here and read about it. But it does have clues, and if you don't want to backtrack, it's probably a good idea. Find the next journal entry. Okay, okay, okay. Chill. We'll do it. We'll do it right now. Let's uh, start on the right side of this bunker and go left around the world this time. I usually go right around the world, so we'll try something different today. 
Now, we don't need this. We don't need the flare shells. I dropped a whole bunch back at base. Uh, the house across the street from the, um, from the community center. Because we don't need to carry around dozens of those things. We just need to have maybe five or six. So I've got plenty. At least we know it's here. Check these boxes, and then we'll go to the left. Hope nobody needs this anymore. Fisherman sweater. Ooh, it's a heavy cable knit wool sweater. Oh, I bet that thing's fantastic. And wool long johns. Those are tough to beat. We'll check them out. And stale chocolate bar. Sure, why not? Let's check the floor first. And then I can shut off this light. So I don't want to miss anything on the floor, but I don't want to waste... Um, fuel either. Oh. You know what? It's probably not a problem. We have a lot of lantern fuel. <laughs> but I'm gonna do it anyway. Because I'm a saver. So, what have we got here? Oh! Local Legends! It's the big one! Okay. Let's check it out. A book with details about a local pond and its strange aquatic residents. I have a feeling we're about to get a new quest. Local Legends. The big one! Alright. Let's check the map. Okay, that's down to the south from where we are, not too far. But, of course, it's not on our route today. That would be a detour. Uh, gosh. <laughs> Figures. <laughs> oh, these tall tails. They got us going all over the place. Let's open the grate up. Anything inside? Joplin's journal hidden inside. Let's read it. All these quakes are a sign. Old world's coming down around me. Got to be on the move. Can't stay still. Got to get away, got to get up higher. Some place in the open sky, past the timberline, way up. Is that a poem or something? Sounds like poetry. Very nice, very nice poetry. All right, so we got a new journal entry. Let's go read it. Locate the third bunker. All right. <laughs> Easy peasy. Let's check the map. There it is. Joplin's bunker raid. That's back toward community center. Thank goodness. That one will be uh, easy to get to. There's a lot of food here, and I don't think we're going to need it all. Plenty of chow. Looks like this has been here oh, a while. Oh, yeah, yeah, we're not taking that thing. 17%. The MRE will sna- uh, yeah, No. No, we don't need it. Too heavy. We don't need the water. i got plenty of water. Yeah, I feel like the story mode is just loaded with chow. You're just not really fighting for survival in this mode. See how much food we have already. I mean, look at all. Look at it all right here. It's crazy. Um, but we don't want to eat anything that's stale because you can actually get food poisoning. So I might drop this stuff and just grab, or just eat what's halfway decent. Like this condensed milk is really super duper. I mean, it's good for you. I'm just not sure it tastes great. <laughs> but it does fill the belly. It hydrates. Fantastic stuff. Let's check that energy useful. bar. Uh, 57%. You can get food poisoning from that. I think the chances are pretty slim. But anything over 75, I believe, will not give you food poisoning. So I'll go through all that off camera. Hmm. Okay. That's a good soda. New beef jerky, 72%. Ah, close enough. And a ragged wool toque. Pronounced toque. No, we don't want that. Um, all right. Yeah, let me just make sure I didn't miss anything here, and we're all, we're all warmed up again. We got the uh, we got the the clue, so I guess we're done here. And look at that, the sun is still rising. It's nice and early, and we made really good time. Now the question is, where do we go from here? Where do we go from here? Do we go down south, check on the magical pond, or do we go farther than north like we had planned? And go check on the ghostly stag. And then get to the church artifact. Hmm. Alright, well we shall consult the bones. Like the uh, like in the old days to determine our fate. We'll let the spirits decide um, what our path is. But first, let's check this, um, this new sweater here. 90% sweater, so it's not completely new. But it is wool. And although this is wool too. Yeah, wool is great in cold weather activities, especially... When it gets wet, it retains a lot of its insulation. And this one looks like it's just better all around. I mean, it's a fisherman's sweater, right? So they know best. Yeah, we're going to put that on. It's fantastic. Uh, and we also got some new wool underwear, right? Let's check the red 
undies here and they seem to be better yes more waterproof better physical defense and more warmth so let's um let's put those on over these instead of those and there we go all right and now we can drop trow drop the old stuff right here bam we don't need it and the sweater all right cool yeah we just don't need to carry any extra weight and now i'm gonna refill my lantern Got plenty of fuel on us, and we're gonna just make sure we didn't miss any little bullets is hiding in the corners. And then we shall consult the bones. Do we have any bones? Uh, I don't think we have any bones. We'll, you know what? We'll just we'll just decide on our own then. Okay. Nothing here. Back out into the wilderness. And how's the weather now? Oh, it's settled down. Not too shabby. So, I think we should go far then. Since the weather is cooperating, I think we should go check on the ghostly stag. Um, and then the church artifact. And this is going to be a long, long way here. I mean, we could stop um, like at Molly's house to warm up. But I think we're going to follow the road and go to this river and to the north. Because I don't think we've been down that way before. So, I think that, um, yeah, I think that makes sense. Okay, let's get back on the road. All right, just gonna run straight down the road, get to the river, and follow it to the north to the ghostly stag um, sighting, or whatever it is. Maybe I should just check that quest to make sure that we're doing the right thing. Locals tell of a ghostly stag. Go to the ghost stag's clearing. Okay, yep, <laughs> here we go. Let's follow the river now due north and we'll go um find out more about this stag the ghostly stag i hope we don't have to kill it because i didn't bring the rifle and that seems like that would be a tragedy anyway i mean we could shoot at it with the handgun but i don't know how many rounds it would take to bring down a stag with this revolver and i'd prefer to use it for self-defense against those timber wolves that we have not seen in a long time. Knock on ice. Knock, knock, knock. Oh, look at that. The temperature's up now. Ooh, it's hot. Whoa, bear. Whoa, bear. Bear crossing the river. <laughs> Very slowly. Good thing the temperature's not cold. Because squatting here on the ice would not be good for us. Would it? All right, I think we can probably get around that thing. Look how slow he's going. Come on, bear. Get a move on. Didn't you hear? Bear left. Get out of here. Holy cow. All right, how much farther do we have to go? We got a long way to go. Now, I hope we're not uh, upwind. Whoa, 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 whoa. Is he breaking the ice? I think he just slipped. Now he's drinking. Maybe there's a hole there. And he's back on his path. Okay. That's good, bear. Whoa. Now we're slipping and sliding over here, too. Is this weak ice? Yeah, I hope we're not upwind of the bear. Because that would mean the wind would be blowing toward him from us, and he would catch our scent. Right? Upwind. All right, there he goes. He's reached the shore. And he's just going in a straight line. That's a good bear. I wonder where he came from. Are those bear turds? No. <laughs> Maybe there's a cave up here. Let's check the map. That looks very interesting. Hmm. Should we go check his home? I think he lives up here. We could go burglarize his house while he's away. Oh, yeah. There is a cave here. Okay, cool. We'll get it on the map. We don't really need to warm up. But there might be some goodies in here. Oh, bones! There's the bones! Let's consult the bones! I think the bones say... Go to the ghostly stag. Whew! Okay, we made the right decision. Um, wait a minute. I might have misread the bones. The bones say, get the heck out of here before the bear comes back. Uh, I've never really been very good at reading bones. Yes, it's been a long time since I took my Shaman 101 course back in college. But, you know how it goes. Alright, let's get out of here. We have consulted the bones, and we are apparently on the right path. And 
And now the wind's kicking up. Visibility's starting to drop. Uh, at least the bear's gone. Now what is that right there? Oh, we got music. Is that a house of some kind? Hmm. I don't know. Uh, hard to say. It could just be a rock. Oof. All right. Let's get to that stag. All right. Let's let Astrid catch her breath because she sounds like she's pooped. And now we're going to have to climb up, it looks like. That looks really steep. Um, can we get up here, perhaps? Uh, there's actually a bridge up ahead, but I think... I think what we're looking for is right up here. Alright, dig in, Astrid. You can do it. Up we go. How's our weight, by the way? Alright, we got plenty of leeway. 11 pounds. It's just so quiet out here. Quiet can be good and bad. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What do we got here? Some kind of witchery. What are those things? <laughs> it's an army of scarecrows. There's a little cabin or something over there. This looks very freaky with the crow squawking in the background. Actually, crows are good, right? Don't they signify something special? We should go check in on it. Uh, yeah, we're, we're smack dab in the center of this ghost stag thing. Uh-oh. Saved. Hide in the snow shelter and watch for the stag. Oh. Is that what this is? Oh, there's a snow shelter. <laughs> there's a backpack here. Oh, this is probably left here from the last person that hid in the shelter and got eaten by the bear that snuck this up. This stuff will come in Ooh. handy. Rabbit skin mitts. Those are fantastic. A fire striker. In terrible shape, but I'll take it. And a lousy MRE, which we're not going to take. Well, let's climb on in. I hope there's enough room for everybody. In we go. Um, use. Oh, we're in. We're resting? No, I don't want to rest. <laughs> what are we resting for? Oh, no. It goes Is all... That... I can't believe it. <sighs> it's the ghostly stag. I didn't realize we we're going to spend all night here. Well... Check that off the uh, old bucket list, I guess. It is beautiful. Look at that thing. All right, let's shoot it. Get out. Just kidding. Let's just observe for a moment here. Look at this bunny over here. Get out of here. You're going to blow our cover. <laughs> what you see his ears perk up. Yeah, that's a cool stag. It's a white one. I guess it's just very rare. Oh, it's beautiful. I wish I could zoom in. Can I zoom in? Can't zoom in. Do we have binoculars or something? No. What time is it, by the way? Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? I did not expect the day to pass in the shelter. I thought maybe it would have happened quickly, but I guess that makes sense. Okay, well, this is nice and everything, but I think we should go now. Um, what are we supposed to do here? Just sit and watch and have a soda. It's fantastic. All right, we gotta get out of here. We're going to have to get to some shelter. Let's look at our map and get to the uh, Draft Dodgers cabin, which is still quite a hike, but we should go. All right, out we go. Does he see us? He still doesn't see us. It's a beautiful animal. Can we get a little closer? I mean, I suppose we could shoot it. I mean, I don't want to shoot it. That'd be horrible. Maybe, oh, we put the gun away. We come in peace. Ghostly stag. Aww. He was cool. Alright, let's let's go. I mean, I guess we could spend the night here. At the Three Strikes Farmstead. Three strikes! Three strikes and you're out. Oh. It's frozen carcass. A bunch of stones. Fire barrel here, that's good. And a rifle! Oh, look at all the goodies. <laughs> Like I said, this uh, this story mode is just chock full of the goodies. Forest Stalker Collectible Part 1. Dot, dot, dot. Pristine wilderness with barely a hint of humanity to spoil it. If we can bring our message here and succeed, it will show the rest of Great Bear what is possible. Pleasant Valley is where we make our stand. All right, we'll take it. 
And we got some chow, first aid kit. I mean, what do we really need? This will come in handy. Yeah. All right, we don't need antiseptic. Got tons of it. Take the bandage though. Lantern fuel, sure. Let's see what's in the metal container. Ooh, rifle bullets is, and another lousy MRA. Again, we don't really need these. Got so much food. Uh. I think I can use take this. The accelerant. That's a nice knife. I think that knife is better. And what we're carrying, and that bedroll looks good. Condensed milk is fantastic. Firewood. Yeah, this is a great camp. We can just spend the night right here. And another hunting rifle. Well, we have two hunting rifles already. Oh, it's a hatchet in the wall. You know what we need is a whetstone. One thing we have not ever found in the story mode yet is a whetstone to sharpen up the um, knives and the hatchet. But here's what we're going to do. I am going to drop that. Oh, both knives are 90. Drop that. Don't need all of these. And that bad roll. All right. Fantastic. Now, let's have a look at the map and see how far we are from the Draft Dodgers cabin. Well, really far. So, uh, <laughs> we could just spend the night here. We got the fire. Uh, nah. Let's just go. It's a beautiful night. I think we can make it. I mean, it's not that far. We'll just get on the river, follow the river, and then uh, we'll be there. In no time flat. Although, I guess we should check this place out, too. Not sure we need anything else. We've got so much stuff. Oh, wait. Coal. Coal could be good. Nobody needs this anymore. Not the plug, just the coal. Yeah, this could be useful for the community center, because we're still a little bit short on Bernie things. That ought to do the trick. Okay, Draft Dodgers Cabin. We're going for it. A nice night to do so. It's warm. We still got some light. Feel like we can do it. Let's just get over to the road and then um, we'll head that way. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wow! Oh gosh. <laughs> that was a longer fall than I thought. Okay, and now we'll walk. Okay, we'll get to the Draft Dodgers cabin and figure out the next step for the church artifact. Just like I said we would. I didn't realize we're going to spend half the day hiding in the, uh, the snow shelter waiting for the stag. Oh, cave paintings. Cool. All right, so I'll see you guys at the da Draft Dodgers cabin unless something amazing happens along the way. You will be the first to know. So hang tight. Be right back. Oh, look at the fire burning off in the distance over there. Terrible, terrible tragedy. Uh-oh. Wolves. Uh. Maybe we should go back. <laughs> I mean, the wolves do hunt at night, right? I think. Uh, let's push on. Let's push on. Oh, there's a shelter of some kind here. All right. Oh, there's wolves right there. All right, let's just... These are not timber wolves. So we can avoid them. We can distract them. Um, uh-oh. I think we're upwind of this wolf here. You turned directly toward us, and here it comes. Oh, boy. That's not good. Yeah, it's coming right at us, isn't it? Well, we have plenty of ammunition. I'm not too concerned about it. Maybe we can get to that little shelter there. Yeah, it seems like... Really? Oh, no. Oh, his eyes are flashing. Oh, no, it's timber wolves. That's not what we wanted. <laughs> All right, well, we'll take him here on the bridge. Take him here on the bridge. Fall back. I know they come from two different directions. Two different directions is it. Oh, here he comes. Yeah, that's right. Beat it. 